Hey guys, André here. So today I want to show you the Strandberg Bosen Classic 6, uh, which, by the way, please don't judge the guitar for what you just heard, uh, because this is definitely not a, a guitar that only makes uh, kind of heavy sounds, uh, heavy rock or metal. Uh, it's actually really versatile. Uh, and I know what you're thinking. Uh, so, where is the headstock? The tuners are here. Um, fan frets. Oh, and check this out. Check this neck. I hope it's on, in focus. This trapezoidal shape. Uh, they call it the endo neck. Um, it's, I know, it's kind of weird, um, but let me tell you, man, this is uh, one of the best piece of gear that I ever bought, uh, and one of the best guitars that I ever play, uh, most comfortable guitar that I ever play, for sure. Um, if I have to compare this guitar uh, to a regular guitar, uh, I will say this is like a Strat, I think, it's like a Strat. Um, Actually, I just came from this local store and I tried the new Fender American Pro 2. Um, and although it's a really cool guitar, uh, I was like, nah, uh, man, this neck is fantastic and the lightweight and, and even the sound. Uh, not that the Fender didn't sound uh, uh, nice, you know, but there's something this guitar even unplugged it's not that uh, it plays loud because it plays but it's the sound man you can feel the um, vibrations the wood uh, man i don't know man it sounds really good um, so you probably already saw this uh, really great prog and fusion and metal guitar players really technical guitar players uh, playing with Strandbergs, uh, which uh, I think it, it, uh, there is this connotation, this mindset that these guitars are for this kind of players, uh, which to, to tell you the truth, um, it was what kept me away for, for Strandberg, uh, because I'm not a, a fusion guy or a pro guy. Um, uh, but not until I found this uh, killer, killer guitar player, man, uh, which is more like a rock guy, um, which is Kevin Eknes. Man, this, Jesus, man, he's a really killer player. Uh, actually, you know what? Let me show you. told you he's a really killer player um, you should definitely I, I will link the his channel uh, below man you should definitely check out the, his channel he has a lot of gear demos and um, lessons too man I, fi I find really inspiring um, watch him play he's a really good player uh, and by the way thank you Kevin um, and he's a, a, great, a great guy too uh, I've been talking uh, to him uh, the last couple of days. He's a really humble and great guy, man. Uh, 
so you should definitely check out this channel and thank you Kevin um, to let me put this piece of your video here so Kevin Agnes uh, and a few more guitar players more rock guys um, like, like me I guess uh, and this injury uh, was the thing that made me uh, buy a Strandberg um, this injury uh, thanks God uh, is not uh, too serious uh, but I I was searching because I, I was uh, with some pain uh, before I play I don't know like one hour and I couldn't play more because it, it uh, I was it was hurting me uh, the wrists um, but then I, 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 I made a search and I found uh, a lot of people um, claiming that uh, with actually really serious problems um, uh, but they were telling like people that just could play like 10 minutes or 15 minutes uh, with the Strandberg could, they could play now like two three hours uh, non-stop uh, so I was thinking okay let's give it a shot and it's a cool guitar man and I have to say man the, the, in the first day I had this guitar um, I, I made this test with uh, a lot of other guitars uh, with the like the 60s Gibson shape neck um, a modern C uh, modern C a thin C shape neck and in uh, both uh, necks I I felt tension here uh, and the truth is as soon as I play this guitar it, I think that it, it has to be tension uh, but still I I don't feel it uh, man I'm telling you I, I can play the whole day straight non-stop and it's like I didn't play guitar all because of the neck man. Um, it's um, it is what it is um, but it, it, it works man I gotta say it works it works for me at least so b before the specs just a little bit of the story of the Strandberg uh, so Strandberg is, is from Sweden uh, is from Mr. Ola Strandberg um, as, as far as I know he wanted to build a ergonomic guitar and which he did uh, a really one, good one um, the, this guitar these guitars were made uh, in Sweden I think at first uh, then in the US uh, then I think Japan something like this something like that and um, now they are made in Indonesia uh, at the court factory but it's not like uh, the other brands like uh, Schecht or Fender you know all these other brands that make their guitars at the court factory uh, Strandberg has like uh, this factory inside of a factory if that makes sense uh, so it has this department only for Strandberg guitars and the people that make the, the Strandberg guitars um, are trained just to make these guitars uh, so I gotta say man this is a really premium guitar yeah, it's, everything is top quality uh, here uh, so let's check the specs so this is a hollow body uh, solid body uh, because they have a lot of models that are chambered uh, it has a beautiful roasted maple neck uh, maple fingerboard uh, 24 stainless steel frets uh, which are really uh, well done Th this uh, the, the fret ends um, these uh, string lockers I, I think is the name and the bridge the tremolo are made by Strandberg uh, which I believe is some kind of I don't I don't know if it's aluminium uh, but it's uh, some kind of airplane material uh, to be lightweight so really good material um, uh, electronics uh, these pickups are made are Strandberg branded I, I, I don't think they make these pickups because in the other models they have Sur pickups uh, and I have Sur pickups here 
in my collection of pickups um, and let me tell you man the, the core tone the core voice of this pickup is really identical to the soar i have the ssh plus man uh, it's not it doesn't have as much output uh, but it's really identical um, so I not I don't quote me on that but I think maybe sir that makes uh, these pickups uh, which are really good the bridge is kind of hot uh, but are really good pickups uh, the the knobs uh, it has a one volume and one tone CTS pots the volume has a treble bleed circuit uh and then the switch this is really this everything is top um, top notch man uh, you you can really feel it man it's really high quality uh material here um so and yes as far as specs goes man it's it's like a strat older body maple neck um, um it's like a strat uh so as far as ergonomics goes um it has these cuts that you can play like this like a classic guitar player uh you can play like a regular guitar uh you can play like this which you, you are uh completely your backs can be completely straight and even like this uh, because when you play all day long like this man your backs um you can play like this too uh you can play like <laughs> rockstar uh because this is super light so um uh, and that's it man and it's really really light man and let me tell you again it's a really light guitar not toy light uh but it's really light uh, now let me show you how the this neck works. Okay, check this out. Uh, I think that this was made uh, with the idea of the this finger has this line uh, to guide, so you can play in the correct position. You know, correct position. Um, but let me tell you my experience. Uh, so when I play, say a, a bar chord like an F check this out where is my finger and if I move down I'm not doing any effort to play, to put my finger here it's just natural man and so it has a lot of uh, grip and so my wrist it doesn't have to, to make a lot of effort uh, to, to make this kind of positions uh, if I make uh, say uh, uh, an open chord I have this line here which is flat too so again and for lead stuff check this out I'm playing lead uh, there's a lot of grip here man um, man it, it moves exactly like our hands uh, play um, so that's how it works and it works great at least to me so uh, now the, the fan frets uh, check this out uh, not only provide better intonation because this has a um, two scale length scale length uh, 25 on the high h string and 25 and a half on the low h string um, but check this out with the fan frets um, this is my natural position okay uh, in our natural position this finger your index finger is not straight it's always uh, a bit uh, to this side and check this out no matter where I am it's perfectly perfectly uh, matches the, the the position of the frets uh, which it should not happen uh, in the regular uh, uh, fret guitar uh, you should check how check this out in at your guitar and it that's it the the fan frets uh, are made not only for the uh, intonation but because of this and 
this is my first time headless guitar, first time uh, fan fretted guitar, first time 24 <laughs> fret guitar, uh, and man, is the most natural thing uh, uh, to get along. Uh, the, it's, this guitar is it's really easy uh, to play, so no problems at all. So now uh, let's check out uh, some tones. Um, I'm using the fractal, uh, and let's check out uh, some clean tones. Some are crunchy tones, and more you know, more gainy tones. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 